Kowski brings us a story of an Arizona man who finds spiritual images everywhere he sees. What do you see in these photographs? Stunning pictures of Arizona's natural beauty or signs of spirit created by God? This is good. Real good. Meet Douglas Ham, a professional photographer for more than 40 years. He even studied under Ansel Adams and now lives near Roosevelt Lake. There it is, have at it. He's purely old school. His equipment from the 1960s in pristine condition. No digital here, which makes his untouched images even more remarkable. And you'll see, it's got a wonderful Arizona color along with Arizona Southwest design. But you'll see a lady right here with her head bowed and her body and her legs here and a Bible on her lap. She's either meditating or in prayer or reading her Bible. Not convinced? How about Fern Springs? You'll see the Indian's chin, his lips, his nose, his eye, headband, and feathers. And then over here, right below my hand, you'll see an eye and an eye and a snoot of a wolf. And right above, you'll see an eye and an eye and a beak of a hawk. And over here, you'll see a lady pr praying. Her hair is flowing right here. Her head is bowed. And here's her body right here. A bridge and its reflection form the Christian fish. A mountain sunrise reveals a giant godlike hand. But most impressive, in a massive cliff wall at Canyon de Chez, Jesus. You can see the halo above his head, the uh, crown of thorns on his head, the three crosses. The precious Lamb of God right in that circle, and the dove of the Holy Spirit. To realize that God created that in rock before Jesus went to the cross. That's how good God is. Hey, I see Jesus in a lot of those images. All right, you can find out more about Douglas Ham by checking out the newsroom hotline or on our website or at the number right there at the bottom of your screen. I think we've got some callers already on this one.